<clears throat> so I'm just gonna ask you guys, just kind of play along. He's no good. Um, <laughs> he even got dressed up and everything. So just, uh, just, just humor him, okay? It's, it's gonna be fine. And our next comedian's a very funny guy, Joe Ho. Hey, thanks, Marshall. I didn't hear what he was saying as I was coming through the door, but he is one of the nicest guys, I gotta say. He told me he's gonna tell me what it feels like to kiss a girl tomorrow. And, uh, he might let me do his entourage. I'm just so, so, so excited for the possibility. Uh, but yeah, I've got a few jokes for you, and then I'll get back to, uh, parking your cars. <laughs> of its own. So, uh, Indians. Yeah. Who am I talking about? There's no way to know, because back in 1492, Columbus sailed the ocean blue looking to find India, and uh, despite finding nothing in common with India, he was like, I'm not racist, anyone can be Indian if they're brown. <laughs> But now we know them as Indians. Like, what kind of denial do you have to be living in to do something like that? Like, oh, this is your uh, famous Indian curry, right? That is corn. <laughs> yeah, okay, sure it is. But what about those over there? Those are your uh, famous Indian elephants, right? <sighs> that is also corn. <laughs> I thought somebody said they had tusks. They have husks. What are you doing here? You're not the place. Columbus going to America and calling the natives Indians is like if you started a new job and the boss comes up and says, Welcome to the company. My name's Pierce. And you say, Hi, Bob. And you call him Bob for 500 years. And his friends always come up to you like, why do you keep calling Pierce Bob? That's not his name. And you're like, that's just how I've always known him. And they're like, no, that's what you named him. There's like a billion other guys in the world named Bob, and he's not one of them. All the Bobs work in tech support. They're always just following you around, Pierce this and Pierce that. Just a trail of Pierce haunting you every day. Terrible. Eventually, you move up in the company, you take Pierce's job, but he's still in the company, right? But you move him to smaller, worse offices over time. Eventually, you just put the plumbing through his office. Like, what is going on? I know, right? Yeah. Eventually, he gets fed up and is like, I'm just gonna build a casino. Screw you guys. 